karyotyping and the nomenclature of the chromosomes if we take the example of a male there are 46 chromosomes out of 46 chromosomes there are 44 autosomes and there are two sex chromosomes if we if we want to write the nomenclature of a normal male chromosomes so it will be 46 and x and y 46 will represent to the total number of chromosomes while x and y they will represent to the sex chromosomes if there is anything written in addition to 46 x and y it mean that represents to the anomaly of that individual which is present in the structure or in function of the structure or number of the chromosomes if we want to describe a anomaly which is present in the individuals how it will be written or how it will be represented here is 46 46 means the total number of chromosomes which are present in that individual or which are present in that species in addition to 46 it is written at that a pair of sex chromosome is present so this is the description about a male because in male there is one x chromosome and one y chromosome and if we see that it is written in this form that 47 then comma xy plus 21 it means that the total number were actually were 46 but this individual has 47 chromosomes here is written 47 and there is one x and one y chromosome and additional chromosome is 21 so this person has one additional chromosome the chromosome is 21 and it this anomaly will be written as 47 xy plus 21 description of the anomalies that we found in case of males and females we will usually see that there is written 47 xx plus 21 47 triple x 69 xxy 45 xx der then 46 xy t 46 xx del 46 xx dup 46 xy inv 46 xy fra and 46 xy or it can be 47 double xy we will see one by one what are the meanings of description as it was mentioned in the beginning of this lecture that 46 is the number of chromosomes and xy represent to the sex chromosomes of that individual in this case we can see that there is written 47 xx plus 21 it means there is a addition of a chromosome 21 if there is addition of one of the chromosome that is chromosome 21 then it is called as trisomy of chromosome 21 usually trisomy of chromosome 21 produces down syndrome in the children in the next case we can see that it is written 47 and triple x triple x mean the x chromosome which was actually it should be in two forms it is in three forms there are three x chromosomes in a normal female there are only two x chromosome so this syndrome is called as triple x syndrome if there is written 69 xxy it means that is triploidy triploidy mean the each set of chromosome consist of three chromosomes instead of two chromosomes if we take the example that there are 23 chromosome in the form of pairs 
if we multiply 23, uh, 23 with 3, it will become 69. So instead of 46 chromosomes, such individuals, they have 69 chromosomes. Such a phenomena is called as triploidy. In the next, there is written 45 XXDER. The meaning of this one, that there is deletion of one chromosome. Originally, it should be 46 chromosome, but in such an individual, the number of chromosomes, they are 45 because there is deletion of one chromosome. That is due to the uh, process which is called as Robertsonian translocation. In the next case, there is written 46 X, 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 Y and T. 46 is the total number of chromosome. X, Y, they are the sex chromosome and there is a reciprocal translocation between the chromosome 2 and chromosome 4. In case of 46, X, X, D, E, L, it means there is deletion on chromosome 5. This is deletion on chromosome 5. 46, X, X, D, U, P is for the duplication. There is a duplication on the short arm of chromosome 2. 46 XY INV is the abbreviation of the inversion that there is an inversion on chromosome 11. 46 XY FRA means the total number of chromosome are 46. There is X chromosome, Y chromosome, but there is a deletion of chromosome X. So due to the deletion on chromosome X, a syndrome is produced in the individuals or in the children which is called as fragile X syndrome. In case of 46XY or 47XXY that represents to the mosaics that has normal number of chromosomes, 46XY they represent two mosaics while 47XXY that represent to Kleinfeld syndrome. So these are all the description of the anomalies which are usually seen during the karyotyping of the humans. Nomenclature is a process by which we can detect that where is the uh, deletion in the chromosome and how the chromosomes, they, if they, the chromosomes are deleted or there is any other abnormalities in the chromosome, how we can write or how we can represent to those anomalies.